One level up from print are assertions, which are debug only checks that will force your app to crash if a specific condition isn't true. On the surface, that sounds terrible. Why would you want your app to crash? Well, there are two reasons. First, sometimes making your app crash is the least bad option. If something has gone catastrophically wrong, if some fundamentally important file is not where it should be, then it may be the case that continuing your app will cause irreparable harm to user data, in which case crashing, while a bad result, is better than losing data. Second, these assertion crashes only happen while you're debugging. When you build a release version of your app, i.e. when you ship your app to the App Store, Xcode automatically disables your assertions so they won't reach your users. This means you can set up an extremely strict environment while you're developing, ensuring that all values are present and correct without causing problems for real users. Here's a very basic example. We'll say assert one is equal to one, and if that fails for some reason, we'll write math failure. Of course, that will succeed, so the assertion will do nothing at all. As a second example, we'll write assert one is equal to two, and if that succeeds, that do nothing, otherwise fail, which of course it will do, and print math failure. So this first assertion will do nothing because one is equal to one, and the second one will fail because one is not equal to two. As you can see, each call to assert takes two parameters, something to check, in our case, one is equal to one, or one is equal to two, plus a message to print if the check fails. So if the check evaluates the false, your app will be forced to crash because you know it's not in a safe state, and you'll see the error message in our debug console. You can, and indeed should, Add these assertions liberally to your code because they help guarantee your code state is what you think it is. The advantage to assertions is that the check code is never executed in a live app, so your users are never aware of their presence. This is different from print, which would remain in your code if you shipped it, albeit mostly invisible. In fact, because calls to assert are ignored in release builds of your app, you can do complex checks. For example, you might say something like this. Assert my really slow method which doesn't exist yet, but that's okay, uh, is true. And if that fails, we'll say uh, the slow method returned false, which is a bad thing. Boom. Now, of course, uh, this really slow method doesn't actually exist. So you'll get a compiler error right now, but you get the idea. And that will only execute while you're running test builds. That code will be moved entirely when you build for the App Store. So, Assertions are like running your code in strict mode. If your app works great with assertions on, i.e. nothing that was wrong would make your app crash, then it'll work even better in release mode.